Wireless Power Transfer Wireless Power Transfer is the transmission of electrical energy, without wires or a physical link. The technology of wireless power transmission can eliminate the use of the wires and batteries, thus increasing the mobility, convenience, and safety of an electronic device for all users. Wireless power transfer is very useful, where interconnecting wires are inconvenient, hazardous, or are not possible. In this video we will learn how wireless power transfer is done. These are the components, which are needed in this project. 1. NPN, transistor, BC547, 1 kilo ohm resistors, 2, 37 gauge, 17 ton, copper coil, 1, 37 gauge, 34 ton, copper coil, 1 red LED, 1.5 volt AA battery, AA battery holder, on off, rocker switch, 1 zero PCB, 4 screw with nuts, and 4 plastic spacers. Here is the circuit diagram of this project. We are using a 1.5 volt AA battery to power up the circuit. When we switch on the circuit, then the base terminal of transistor will get a high signal from this path, and transistor will turn on. When transistor will turn on, then current will start flowing through this path. When current will pass through this copper coil, then no current will left for this path, so transistor will get a low signal at its base terminal, and turn off. When transistor will turn off, then it will cut the supply for this, coil and turn on again, so transistor will give a continuous square wave to this coil. This coil will generate a continuous varying magnetic field, around itself. This magnetic field will induce in the receiver coil, and convert back into electrical power. LED will use this electrical energy to glow. These are the components, which we will use, to make our project. First of all we will make the copper coils using copper wire. Now we will solder a red LED with the copper coil. We will make a PCB base, and for that, we will take a zero PCB, and make a hole at each of its corner. Now, we will insert a 1 inch screw, inside the hole. Now we will take a plastic spacer, and then we will use a nut to lock the spacer. Now our PCB base is ready. To switch on or off our project we will use an on off switch. We need to make a big hole to fit this switch on the PCB. Now we will solder the transistor. There are three pins in a transistor. Pin 1 is called collector, 2 is called base and 3 is called emitter. Now we will mount it on the PCB. Now we will solder the 1 kilo ohm resistor. Now we will connect the copper coil with our circuit.
Now we will connect the AA battery holder with our circuit. Now we will connect a 1.5 volt AA battery and test our project. We can see that our circuit is transmitting the power wirelessly. Receiver side LED is glowing when it comes near the transmitter. Our circuit is working perfectly. I hope you enjoyed the video and learned something from it. For any help or to clear your doubts regarding your project, you can contact us on our student care number, 7007957715. To buy the items used in this project, you can visit our website, www.eraltech.com. You can give us the orders on WhatsApp also. Thank you so much.